Hello everyone, Kevin here from Zorua635 on Jemmy Master Animatronics and today I will be reviewing two Jemmy robots. Now you might be thinking to yourselves, the one on the little, the little robot right here, yes we all know that one's Jemmy, but now you're all probably like, what? This one right here is Jemmy? There's no way that's Jemmy. Well, we'll get to him in a minute, but first we're going to start off with this little guy. This is the Jemmy... Min E robot. This is a little bump and go robot. Um, I'm not sure what year he's from. Someone once said it was like 2005 or six, but when I open him up to repair him on his circuit board, it says 2008. So I'm not too sure what year he's from. But yes, this is a little robot. It looks like a walkie-talkie, you could say, or metronome. Um, he has posable arms. He has like really good. Uh, like posability, like articulation, like you can bend the elbow, shoulder, twist, and his claw opens and closes. Same with the other arm. Um, his eyes light up, he plays music, and he has a gyro wheel at the bottom. Um, when I got this guy, he was missing the tires, like the little rubber tires on the wheel, so I had to go to a... Um, <clears throat> A hobby, well not a hobby store, but like a uh, hardware store and I bought some small belts and of course they fit perfectly. Here says Jemmy. Requires three AAA batteries. So here he is in action. Yeah, sometimes his gyro wheel gets a little bit stuck, not sure why. Because he's just going to spin around then. Alright, next one we have is Son of a Bucket. This is the one that a lot of you might be thinking, I've never seen this before, there's no way this is Jemmy, but this is this is Son of a Bucket, an RC disc shooting robot made back in 2005, and due to the way how he is, I think he was sold at Spencer's, there's no evidence on this box that says Spencer's at all, but once you see this thing in action, you'll probably be like, okay, yeah, that would make sense. So... First, let me show you the box. Of course, he has like a try me hole and all. Plastic. You get a user manual in there too. Um, so here's what it says. Son of a bucket. He puke. He pukes action discs. He mouths off. He drinks way too much. Press the chug and puke buttons on the remote. And watch SOB puke out an action disc. Of course, when he's in the box... He doesn't do that because he doesn't have the discs loaded in him. Of course, here's a side panel. Included wireless remote control lets you control your sob, your Sobot's next hilarious action. Aim your Sobot for puking action discs. Is he drunk? Run the sobriety test. And here's the back, which pretty much just repeats. Of course, this is Jemmy. Literally, this is Jemmy. So yeah, pretty much, um, what's it called? This one, if you, any of you want to get one of these, all I can say is if you find a robot that looks similar to him, be warned because this is actually a copy of the original robot called Richie Robot. It looks exactly identical, same remote, same everything, except the box. box is different, of course. So you see one without the box, and they have it as Richie, then it's more like a Richie, but... If a lot of people don't know that the real name of this one, if it's just the robot itself, so you'll never know. You find a robot only, and they just say battery operated disc shooting robot, then it's it's more likely going to be Richie than a son of a bucket. Oh yeah, and also with this being a Jemmy, huge credits to Zodak Lear sixty five because he's actually the one who found out this robot was a Jemmy. Which was actually quite shocking because on the listing it said Gammy Industries and we just thought that, hey, it's just probably some other company. But he actually did research and he found this one robot forum and it turned out to be this was Jemmy. So I was like, holy crap. 
And one thing is for sure is this isn't something that I would usually get, I should say. I mean, it's a robot, so I would get but he kept on begging me to get this to review it because he was curious to know what it does. And, of course, mm-hmm. I was like, okay, fine, I'll buy it. So I spent, like, $26 on this. This thing was, like, somewhat new and used. The sellers had a list as new, but the box was taped twice, so I think this was returned at some point. So, yeah. Uh, what you get in, in the box, of course, you get the robot, you get a remote, you get 24 blue discs. For some odd reason, in the photo that they used, there was two in the photo, but I think it was a stock photo. The robot beside it was actually this one, and the one out of the box was the one that had green discs, which is supposed to come with green discs because, you know, it's supposed to represent, like, vomit and all that stuff. So, yeah. You guys get the, mu- the user manual in there, too. Here's the remote. Simple actions. You got turn head left, turn head right, um, chug, puke, turn left, turn right, walk forward, backwards, slide forward, backwards, um, dance, and sobriety test. So this robot does have two modes. He's already turned on. He uses four AA batteries, and the remote uses two AA's. So here's the demo. Alright, so that was just his demo, and then here's the full start. Hey, you touched my button. Let's celebrate. <laughs> Let's party. Oh, I'm gonna puke. <laughs> How may I serve you? Now that you're able to, now that you heard what he said, pretty much you can see why this would more likely be sold at Spencer's. Anyway, so here let's start off with turn head left, turn head right. Walk forward. Slide. Oh, wait. Walk backwards. Slide forward. Slide backwards. And now, let me turn him around. Actually, you know what? I have a better idea. Let me put the box here. And now, here's this disc shooting action, or should I say his puke disc shooting, whatever. So yeah, that was um, him shooting out discs. Of course, the discs that were used came from a different robot. But yes, he comes with blue discs, so these were the same. Anyways, um, here's his dance demonstration. Ooh, want me to dance? So that was his first dance, and also a quick little memo. If you're watching this video and for some odd reason it kind of jumps to certain areas, I don't know why, but my phone has been has been acting up a lot lately. So if needs so, we'll probably redo the review again. But anyways, here's Sober Test, which is the second dance. Uh, one uh, one little interesting thing is the uh, the music he plays sounds like from an old retro video game, which is kind of cool compared to like a uh, Robbie Robot. His music is like more modern. Anyways, here's the sovereignty test. I'm not drunk. I can walk just fine. Watch. Yep. 
so this has been the review on the Jemmy Son of a Bucket Robot and Mini Robot. Hope, yeah, <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Thanks for watching and bye. And also, Ivan wants to say something. Ah, uh, shut up! Okay, anyways, thanks for watching and bye.